Coach Epora, racing for Monster Energy Kawasaki Racing Team. I'm Kyle Retro, riding for Ars 1, Cosmobono Racing. So let's take a quick look then around this circuit. Here's our GoPro track preview of the LaSalle circuit in Qatar. A long start straight into a very wide sweeping left hand turn through a couple of single rollers that automatically push you out to the right hand side, set you up for turn two. The right hander immediately we're into the wave section through the turn. About 91 meters long through there. Then we end up at turn three. 180 degree left hand turn and get Pretty soft through there and also it's pretty tight over a single. It's an off camber jump there as well. And then eventually we end up going through a right over a big step down into this tight right hander. Again, over a small single and then into another right hander. Over the Ippon jump into the left. Off camber through there from left to right. So falling high side to low. A single on the way out into this right-hander. Jordi Tixier fell through there last year in one of the races. Over a big tabletop jump into this right-hand turn here. You see how rutted and hard pack it is in different places as well. Through this left. Probably one of the longest left-hand turns on the racetrack. As you hook through the gears, through the single, and then over a huge step up. It's quite a stretch on the 250 machines. Hard on the brakes at the end of the straight through that right hand up over a tabletop and then into the very slow tight right hander We're about three corners from the finish line here at this point over the single through the next left over scrub hill and then over the quad jump some guys taking it as four some taking it as a three and a one so this is the monster energy finish line jump then pretty big stretch through there and then as they ride through the next part, that used to be two singles coming into this right-hand turn, but the rider's able to double that this time around. Through the tight right, over another single, exit the next left, past pit lane, and into the final turn in terms of the lap prop up. We exit there, it's a short burst, and we're back onto the start straight. That completes the lap here in LaSalle. <laughs>